Fire green drivers, ready in one, ready in two, ready in three. Go! The Soapbox Derby is a race rich in history and heroics. The Soapbox Derby is really the longest running youth activity of its kind in the world. It's the second oldest traditional race in the country other than Indy 500. For nearly 70 years, kids have competed in the annual event held in Akron, Ohio. While the cars have changed, the fundamentals have remained the same. Bill's character in, in, in the youth, and I think it, it was so good for my brother and I both to be able to, to run in the Soapbox Derby, and that was probably the first competition I'd ever had in a car. It's every bit as big as the Brickyard 400 or the Daytona 500, even more emotional. Oh my God, you did so good! Soapbox champions come from all over the world for a chance at racing immortality. My name is Andre Langston. I am 13 years old. I'm from the west side of Chicago. What I see when I walk around the street, I see people in my alley selling drugs. I see lots of shootings. It's like at nighttime, where I be going to bed, and they be shooting in front of my house. Andre found refuge at Off the Street Club, a nonprofit organization in Chicago's West Side. Off the Street Club has never been needed more than it is today. When we came to the club when I was a kid, about the worst thing that happened is it rained on the way. Uh, today, our kids, it's raining bullets. Thanks to Soapbox, Andre traveled outside of Chicago for the first time, where he won the regional championship. I'm so excited. I can't wait. I didn't ever, like, get this feeling for it. Some people will come from all over the world. I think Andre maybe comes from the longest because he walks these mean streets of the west side, and his has been a long road to Akron, Ohio. In other areas of the country, the path to Akron is far different. My name is Cameron Kiesler. I'm 13 years old. I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. I have never been to an extremely bad neighborhood. This is a great neighborhood. Me and my dad are always working and tuning up our car. Hey, boy. Shut up. How are you going? I'm Kara Atkins. I'm 11 years old, and I'm from Indianapolis, Indiana. Kara often visits the Indianapolis Motor Speedway where she sometimes meets NASCAR drivers. Hi, guys. How are you? Just want to come by and shake your hand and say good luck. I am Jeffrey Robinson. I'm 15, and I'm from Sanford, Florida. I like to be eye-popping eye and just a lot different than most people. Jeff's a great kid. He likes to be a little bit different. <laughs> me and my dad built the car, and me and him find different stuff to do. Jeff and I, through this racing, uh, I gotta compose myself. Through this racing, we've, be, we've really um, grown to just, we know each other really well. Out of 10,000 soapbox racers in the world, 483 make it to Akron. As the children arrive, each one is treated like a celebrity. First time out of Chicago, when I got out of the car, I felt like I was a president. Like the world's greatest man. <laughs> At the social, champs trade souvenirs as well as affection. Cameron may not have found true love, but he did discover an unlikely friendship. Me and Andre have great times together. Give me two days and me and him are hanging out at water parks. What I like about Cameron is that he's not one of the kids who will just steal a car or beat up somebody who will jump somebody. He can't be friendly. If it wasn't about the Soulbox Derby, I would never have met Cameron because he he's one of the best kids I've ever met before. And uh, he'd be like a best friend to me. As part of NASCAR's youth initiative, drivers attend the Derby. No problem. Sorry. <laughs> I like Tony Surrey because he's cool, like he comes to our races. To come here and see their biggest race of the year, it's, it's something that's really special. Being able to see the families and kids enjoy themselves all day like they do, and it's a pretty neat experience watching these guys. As added entertainment, 
two NASCAR drivers accompanied their sons on the hill. Okay, what's the strategy? Stewart selected his new friend to gain a competitive edge. Some drivers race for more than glory. To Andre Langston, Akron was already a dream realized. I can't be too nervous and too scared. I just gotta do it and have fun. That's what it's all about, having fun. Andre lost his heat, but he won much more. Each year, kids like Andre see a world outside the inner city and get to meet all the different people in it. For every dream realized, another is lost. Families felt the full range of emotions on this eventful day.